Welcome to the Mind Spark, bringing you the latest news from around the world. Tonight, we begin with a story that stretches across billions of miles, a story of human ambition, endurance, and a final chilling message from the darkness between the stars. NASA has confirmed it, the last coherent transmission from Voyager 1 has arrived. For months, engineers struggled to communicate with the aging probe, but today, a clear final report reached Earth. The contents? No tea a message from aliens but a stark warning. The data revealed a universe far more hostile than we imagined, a relentless storm of radiation and high-energy particles. Voyager 1 systems after nearly half a century were finally overwhelmed by the raw power of the void. Space, it turns out, is not empty, it's full of forces actively hostile to life and technology. This final lesson changes how we view our search for life beyond Earth. Voyager 1, a relic of 1970s technology has outlived its creator's wildest dreams. It carried our hopes, our music, our greetings, a message in a bottle cast into the cosmic ocean. And now, with its final breath, it has sent back a warning about the very nature of the universe. The probe's journey forces us to reflect on our own small, fragile world. What did Voyager 1 tell us? The specifics are still being analyzed, but the overview is clear. The interstellar medium is a violent, unforgiving place. Its final moments were a testament to this harshness. The chilling reality space is not a welcoming frontier. It's a place that challenges the very possibility of life and technology as we know it. Voyager's last message is a sobering reminder of our place in the cosmos. To grasp the weight of Voyager's final message, we must return to 1977. The world was captivated by space exploration, and Voyager 1 was born from this era of optimism. More than a probe it was a messenger, an emissary for all humanity. Its mission explored Jupiter and Saturn, then slingshot out of the solar system on a one-way journey. Voyager 1 and its twin, Voyager 2, became our eyes and ears in places we could never go. We built a machine, just over 1,500 pounds, and sent it on a journey with no end. It carried our science, our questions, and our art, a vessel of human culture, a time capsule for the stars. This idea captured the world's imagination, a piece of us traveling among the stars. Voyager 1 became a symbol of unyielding curiosity and hope for connection. It was a testament to our desire to know what lies beyond our world. Are we alone? Voyager 1 was our first real attempt to reach out, not just listen. Its launch was more than a scientific endeavor. It was a profound act of faith in the future. Despite our conflicts, we came together to do something extraordinary. Voyager 1's journey is a statement. We are explorers at heart. It represents our hope, our questions, and our willingness to reach for the unknown. Its mission was a gesture of friendship to the cosmos. And now its final message echoes back to us asking what we'll do next. The Voyager mission was made possible by a rare planetary alignment, an event that happens only once every 176 years. In the late 1970s, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune lined up, allowing a spacecraft to use each planet's gravity to slingshot to the next. This gravity assist technique was the key to the Grand Tour, visiting all four gas giants in a single mission. NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory seized the opportunity, designing two robust spacecraft, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2. Voyager 2 would visit all four planets. Voyager 1 would take a faster path, focusing on Jupiter and Saturn before heading into interstellar space. Gravity Assist gave the probes massive speed boosts, making the exploration of the outer solar system possible within a human lifetime. The Grand Tour was a perfect synergy of celestial mechanics and human ingenuity. Both probes were packed with scientific instruments, cameras, spectrometers, magnetometers, and more. Everything was built to survive the harsh environments of deep space. Building two identical probes provided backup and allowed for different scientific objectives. Voyager 1 was the scout, Voyager 2, the marathon runner. Together, they represented humanity's most ambitious leap into the solar system. The alignment was a fleeting chance, and we took it. The result, a journey that would redefine our understanding of the cosmos, Voyager's path was set by the rarest of cosmic opportunities. Voyager 1's journey truly began at Jupiter in 1979. It revealed a world of storms larger than Earth and a dynamic, churning atmosphere. The probe discovered active volcanoes on Io, the first ever seen beyond Earth, transforming our view of moons as dynamic worlds. After Jupiter, Voyager 1 sped to Saturn, arriving in 1980. The rings, once thought to be simple, were revealed as thousands of intricate ringlets and mysterious features. 
Voyager 1 also gave us our first detailed look at Titan, Saturn's largest moon, with its thick nitrogen-rich atmosphere and hints of liquid hydrocarbons. These discoveries made Titan a prime candidate for studying prebiotic chemistry. With its planetary tour complete, Voyager 1's next destination was the stars. Its data changed our understanding of the solar system forever. The journey beyond the planets was about to begin. After Saturn, Voyager 1's mission shifted, become the first human-made object to enter interstellar space. The solar system is sheltered by the sun's magnetic field, the heliosphere. Beyond it lies the true void, filled with cosmic rays and particles from distant supernova. For decades, Voyager 1 journeyed to the edge of the sun's influence. In 2012, after 35 years, it crossed the heliopause and entered interstellar space. This was a landmark in human history, a presence outside our star system. Voyager 1 became a lonely sentinel, sending back data on the interstellar medium's density, temperature, and magnetic field. It was our first direct measurement of the space between stars. Symbolically, Voyager 1 became a true starship, an interstellar traveler. Its journey is a testament to our ambition to explore beyond our home. We had reached out and touched the galaxy. Voyager's crossing is a powerful symbol of humanity's potential. Attached to Voyager 1 is the Golden Record, a gold-plated copper disc, humanity's ultimate message in a bottle. Conceived by Carl Sagan's team, it's a greeting to any alien civilization that might find it. The record contains 115 images nature, human anatomy, science, and daily life. It includes sounds of earth, wind, rain, animals, laughter, and a baby's cry. There's 90 minutes of music from across cultures and eras, from Bach to Chuck Berry. Spoken greetings in 55 languages ancient and modern offer messages of peace. The golden record is more than data. It's a hopeful statement about who we are. It says our civilization is worth remembering despite our flaws. Sagan called it a bottle cast into the cosmic ocean. The record may never be found, but its launch is a symbol of hope. It's a gesture of humility and optimism. Voyager carries our story into the stars. The golden record is a testament to our desire for connection. Voyager 1 is a triumph of 1970s engineering. Its computer has less memory than a car key fob, yet it survived for nearly 50 years. Its power comes from a nuclear battery, slowly fading but steady enough to keep essential systems running. Mission controllers have shut down instruments one by one to conserve power, keeping the probe alive. Communicating with Voyager 1 is a feat. Its faint signal takes over 22 hours to reach Earth. The Deep Space Network's massive antennas pick up this whisper from the void. The probe was built to last five years, it's lasted almost 50. Voyager's endurance is a tribute to human ingenuity and foresight. Sometimes what we build outlasts even our wildest expectations. In 1990, as Voyager 1 left the planetary realm, Carl Sagan requested a final photo of Earth, the pale blue dot. From nearly 4 billion miles away, Earth appeared as a single pixel in the vast darkness. The image became iconic, showing our home's fragility and preciousness. Voyager's final transmission reinforces this lesson. The universe is not welcoming but dangerous and indifferent. Earth is an oasis in a cosmic desert, our only sanctuary. The pale blue dot reminds us of our responsibility to protect and cherish our world. Voyager's journey is a legacy of discovery, engineering, and hope. Its most powerful gift is perspective. We are small, but capable of greatness. On that tiny dot is everyone you love, everyone you know, everyone you ever heard of. Voyager's lesson is humility, and a call to kindness and stewardship. As the probe falls silent, its message endures. The journey is over, but the lesson echoes for eternity. We are explorers, caretakers, and dreamers. Voyager's legacy lives on.